welcome back. I am back with June's first look video with our three new stamp sets. Um, we have two uh, three by four and a four by six stamp set. And um, I'm just gonna get right to it so you can see and then run over to the store if you haven't gotten these yet. The first image is called um, Call Me Ian. And you have an Ian just checking in call me and then a little cell phone i think that's really really adorable um i love his hat i love when ian has hats because i love paper piecing them um, along with the outfits to match the hat um, i love doing this when i'm you know rush for time or i'm going for that certain look um all the stamp sets have coordinating dies that you could purchase as well um i love these photopolymer stamp sets because Look how thin this is. So when you um, store them, you don't need that many, you know, that much space. And I love that about these clear stamp sets. I mean, I do love the rubber, but um, I am just moving, you know, towards this. Obviously, if uh, the Greeting Farm um, continues to produce more rubber stamps, I'm still going to buy them because their images are still super cute. Um, but I do love storing these, and I think I'm going to try and get the DT to do a, a video or a blog post or some pictures that I could insert on a organizing um, your stamp type video. Let me know if that's something you guys want to see, because I definitely want to see how the girls store their stamps and organize them. So anyways, this is Call Me Ian, and I created this simple card, like all my cards are super simple. And um, I just went ahead and did some paint splotches on like um, or acetate sheet and then just sprayed it with water and then smudged my watercolor paper on it. And then I've, as you can see, I've paper pieced his outfit. It made um, creating this card super fast. And that's what I like, especially when I don't have time for it. Um, and then obviously I cut out Ian with uh, the die cut. So the next one is a 4x6 um, Mega Mini Go Time stamp set. And I love this because, you know, you don't have to just use this for cards. These are good for project life or for scrapbooking your travels or memories, you know, like happy road trip. Um, you could have the car here if you're doing a road trip and, you know, put it on a 3x4 card um, and insert it in your project life pockets. So yeah, you get three character stamps, and then you get Happy Road Trip, See You Soon, Vroom, Let's Meet, Go Time, Let's Have Fun, and then you you get this scooter, and then this little, I don't know, VW convertible, and then the swirly thing that you could put behind this, or behind the scooter. Um, I just think it's so cute, and there's so many possibilities. Um, you know, and these have coordinating dies that you can purchase as well. And here you can see I have cut out a bunch of them. So I just think that this stamp set is so stinking cute and perfect for your little traveling, you know, cards for scrapbooking. That's what I'm going to use them for, um, along with making cards. I made this, uh, simple card again, another simple card, um, and just thought I would do this, the car in just pattern paper. And I didn't color the wheels because I really wanted the flower to show. Um, and that's why I love the clear stamp sets because you can see exactly where to stamp. And um, I wanted this to have that retro feel of like the VW van slash um, bugs. So yeah, that's how what I had in mind when I created this card. The next stamp set is um, Text Me Anya. And um, what I love about this is it's also clear. I love coloring hair. I'm not that good in coloring like curly hair. So when I see hair like this, I'm really excited because it's so easy to color her hair and try to get some sort of detail or, you know, highlights in it that I can't with curly hair. Um, so with this Anya comes a Hey Girl and a Text Me and then of course another little cell phone which I think is so adorable. And coordinating dies that you could purchase 
also. And um, yep, so that's Anya. And then this is the card I created. And um, again, I went for another simple card. You Are So Love is th um, from one of our faith-based stamps. And I will link that. I will link every single stuff, any every single product I use in the description box down below. And then um, I went ahead and paper pieced her outfit as well. And see how, what I'm talking about? Um, coloring the hair. It's just so much easier to have that highlight where it doesn't look so bad. Um, and this is a rush work. I really need to practice on my Copic coloring because I have not really been focusing on that. Um, I used to have a lot of time to do it. But anyways, this is from another um, faith-based stamp set, which is, I, th I believe, one of our latest ones. And I'm going to put it all in the description box down below um, so you can see if you want it because you don't only have to use these for faith-based um, uh, or for your Bible, but you can use them for cards as well. So I loved how this turned out, super simple. This is gonna go to my niece for her birthday. And um, so those are the stamps for from the June 12th release. And um, before I go and leave you guys, I wanted to also showcase this American Hero stamp set, which was released, I believe, um, the week before uh, Memorial Day weekend. And um, it was perfect because I think it was released on, on Forces Day. That's when it was released. And um, I love it because my dad, my husband, and my father-in-law all served in the US uh, Navy. And um, what I love about this stamp set is you got sailors. This one right here can go for all the branches of the armed forces because you just have to color them depending on their um, um, branch so navy would well navy used to be blue but they went they changed it to i think a light tan or something like that it's kind of similar to the army and marines um and i think even air force so yeah the, the navy was blue but they recently changed it um so you could use this for all the branches you could also use this for all the branches because all the branches all have pilots so the marine Navy, Air Force, and Army all have pilots. Um, I don't know if Army has it anymore, but I know they used to. I could be wrong, because for some reason I don't hear about Army pilots, but I know that there were pilots. Um, anyways, everything but the sailors you can use for all the branches. So I thought this was a very versatile um, uh, military, armed forces type stamps. And um, this is definitely uh, Veterans Day, you would want to use this for to thank your vet. And you could use this every day. Don't get me wrong. You use this every day for uh, your loved ones who are serving our country um, because they do get homesick. And um, it would be nice to have, you know, send them um, some cards or some goodies and have like a tag made with one of these. I think that would be really cute. So this came out. I'm not quite sure if it's been restocked. Um, this sold out pretty quickly. I did do a giveaway on my um, Instagram, my personal Instagram, which is Islander Girl Creations, and I will put that link down below because I will do giveaways once in a while. Um, this is the card I made using it. So Land of the Free because of the Brave. I didn't really go over the words in here. So let's go. Duty, courage, honor. Thank you for your service. Love our vets. Land of the free because of the brave. These also had coordinating dies that you could purchase as well. Um, also, we hit, I think, a thousand on our YouTube channel. And um, I will be doing a giveaway. So leave a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite stamp set is and where you're from. And I will do, um, I will give it maybe a week to allow you guys to um, enter down below in the comment section about once again what's your favorite um, greeting farm stamp set and where you're from and you ha um, have to be a subscriber um, if you're not a subscriber go ahead and hit the subscribe button and um, I will pick a winner in a week's time from when this video comes up so um, I will put it down below because I'm not quite sure when this video is going to go up. So I'm going to put it down below on how long 
um, the, the giveaway for you to be able to enter into the giveaway and how long you'd have um, till then and, and tell your friends about it. So um, yeah. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you next week or next month actually for the next first look video. And um, we can't wait to see what you create with all the stamp sets. Definitely hashtag us um, so we can see and maybe feature you on our Instagram page. Um, we love seeing what you guys create because you guys are so talented. We will see you next time. All right, take care everyone. Bye-bye.